Hey guys, today we're gonna look at the batch generation feature. So um, let's say you have a lot of clothing images to upload. Um, instead of doing it one by one, you should see now a button here in your asset manager entitled batch upload. Um, you can simply click in here and drag and drop um, images of your clothing. So let me try with this. Uh, let me add just three and they'll show up like this. If you have a front and back feature and back photo of the same clothes and the name of the file is somewhat similar, um, our tool will identify them and group them. If not, you can just uh, drag and drop uh, the photos here to group the ones that that, that are the same item. Um, and then you just hit on upload um, and then it will, will take uh, couple seconds or a couple minutes depending how many you upload them um, please don't close uh, this window while uh, it's doing it <clears throat> and you should see this advancing and you should also see the clothing appear in the background okay so there we have it um, the description here is generated uh, with AI um, it is important because it, it helps the AI understand um, the, the features and the fit of the item we're generating. So I, I advise if you if you don't get good results at the generation, uh, you can come back and see what's in the description. Sometimes there might be some mistakes. Okay, so on the generation. So here, the last page called batch generate. Um, but it's a, it's a bit daunting at first, but here's how it works. Um, first, you need to select the clothing. So if you click here, it will, um, okay, first, if you click here, it will expand so you can see all your clothing at once. Uh, if you click on select all, it will select all the clothing. Uh, this will clear. Um, let's say I wanna run a batch just with t-shirt. So here I'll type in t-shirt and it will um, look for the t-shirt words in every name or description of the clothing. So here I have some sweatshirt, but I have these t-shirts, so let's select all and click on this one to deselect it. This one, this one, this one, um, and this one. Okay, I think I have uh, all the t-shirts. So now um, my prompt, say I want, um, um, I don't know, um, Japanese uh, young male model. Um, let's say I want all the backdrop to be white and um, let's say I want three random photos uh, of each. Then I click on the plus. I get here my sum summary of all the items. This is the camera and this is the number of photo. Uh, if there's some mistakes here, you can remove. Um, you can also add, let's say I want to add a, a black Superman, but this time a front, um, it will add it. So this is the way you, you craft all your list. And when you're done, you just hit uh, generate. So um, it will send in the request. Um, here it says that the batch can take up 15 minutes to start. Actually what we're doing, because we, we intend the batch for a user who are asking us to run thousands and thousands of generation at a time, which can take uh, multiple hours. So what we do to not clog the system is, once you request your batch, um, we, we're gonna we're gonna every fifteen minutes we're gonna look at all the re the requests and try to fit them in um, um, in a way so they don't clog the system. Um, for 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 users who are who are, who are generating like live photos uh, one by one or three by three. So once you've done this, um, you can easily um, leave your screen and, and come back. Uh, uh, like an hour or a couple hours, depending how how many how how many you asked, um, the results will appear uh, as as they are generated. So, uh, let's say this is my Superman T-shirt, and I should see my results appearing here um, as they're treated. Um, you also have uh, here a new view where you can see all your generated assets. Um, Oh, I think this is this is one of the requests. This is my Japanese model. They're they're starting to get generated, and um, 
the progress here should update as t turning percent should update as they're generated. Um, so let's let it run and 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 see the results um, at the end. Okay, my batch is now complete. So uh, let me head to um, my uh, old generated photo views. And here I can see uh, all the t-shirts I um, requested with a Japanese, my Japanese young male model. Oh, I got some female as well. Uh, and from here, um, if you wanna get all your photo at once, use this uh, you can hit select and just select all the photo you want here I'm, I'm I'm pressing shift and going until here the first photo of my batch hit download and it will download them uh, in a zip file and that's about it thanks for watching and please let us know uh, what you think about this new feature or, or, or how we can make it more useful